What's going on everyone? I got a penny stock for you guys to watch. I have high confidence in this one. I'm telling you guys, I have very high confidence in this one and I'm about to share it right now. But before any of that, leave a like down right above the comments below on this video so that we can get this out in the algorithm for other people to find this potential blessing. This company is none other than HCMC Healthier Choices Management Corporation, guys. If you've been following me on Twitter, then you've obviously already known this because I've shared this way back in early December and I've been holding since late November. I was not expecting things to ramp up as soon as they did. I was actually expecting things to kind of start moving up in mid February, which is next month guys and a lot has changed since then guys I was not expecting this one to ramp up as quickly as it did and was planning to do a video actually like a week or two ago but as I said before I have a family I have school and I have obligations so I have to tend to those first before I get here which really sucks sometimes but it is what it is but anyways we can still make this money guys so if you are still new and you're not in on HCMC this is still a decent time to jump in in my opinion but as always I am not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice I'm just giving you my flat out opinion and just information that I have sourced on this company. But anyways, let's get straight to it. So here's a little bit about the company. Healthier Choices Management Corporation, formerly known as VaporCorp, is a holding company. The company is focused on managing healthy food markets and providing consumers with healthy daily choices with respect to nutrition and other lifestyle alternatives. The company's segment includes US-based retailers of vaporizers and e-liquids and the natural and organic grocery operations in Fort Myers, Florida. The company sells direct to consumer through the company owned brick and mortar retail locations. The company operates under the vape store and Ada's natural and organic brands. So let's take a look at the chart really quick. As you can see here, the company's been trading at 0 0.001 for quite some time. And I believe part of that reason is in due because the company has a large outstanding share structure. But we're gonna touch on that later on in the video. As you can see here, the past five days, this company has been seeing a lot of trading action and the price increase has reflected that, guys. So what is going on? Well, February is approaching and what's happening in February? Well, in February, on February 26th, this company is looking to settle a patent infringement settlement with Patrick Moore's company also known as PM on the NYSE and this is no small patent infringement guys take a look for yourself in this press release released on December 1st 2020 which is not very long ago healthier choices management corporation filed a patent infringement lawsuit against Philip Morris OTC Pink HCMC today announced the filing of its patent infringement lawsuit against Philip Morris USA Incorporated and Philip Morris Products SA in connection with their product known and marketed as IQOS. The lawsuit was filed in the United States District Court for the Northern District of Georgia. HCMC's lawsuit includes claims that Philip Morris is infringing HCMC's patent rights in the connection with IQOS as an alternative tobacco product marketed and sold by Philip Morris. Philip Morris claims that it is currently approaching 14 million users of its IQOS product and has reportedly invested over 3 billion in their smokeless tobacco products. Philip Morris has been very open about their ongoing transition. If deemed successful, the lawsuit against Philip Moore's company will grant HCMC with an upward of $2 billion. As seen in the picture, the patent that HCMC owns is to the cartridge that indirectly heats the tobacco. This actually makes it less dangerous once the tobacco is vaporized. And this is what PM and HCMC are going back and forth about. So on which side does this lawsuit seem to lean in favor of? Well, in my opinion, things seem to be leaning in the favor of Mr. Jeffrey Holman. Jeffrey Holman is not only the CEO and chairman of the board at HCMC, but he is also a lawyer. So now that we've got all that out of the way, let's check out HCMC on OTC Market's official site. So as you can see here, just a week ago, HCMC's market cap was sitting at 89 million. Now, if you take a look, as of the 29th, which is only a few days ago, it is sitting at 110 million. So that means there's some money coming into this company right now. Where exactly is this money coming from? We have to wait and find out. 
While you're also on the OTC Markets website, you can also see that this company is penny stock exempt. And here's what that means. A security is exempt from the definition of penny stock under SEC ruling if it meets the following criteria. Number one, a price over $5 per share. Number two, the issuer has an average revenue of at least $6 million for the last three years. Or number three, the issuer has a net tangible assets in excess of $2 million if the issuer has been in continuous operation for at least three years or $5 million if less than three years. So can we really call this one a penny stock? So with the pink current information and market cap information out of the way, now we can talk about the outstanding shares. Now, as you can see here, 138 billion outstanding shares is definitely a lot of outstanding shares, which is probably part of the reason as to why this one's been so hard to push forward. But there has been a lot of talk about a possible share buyback. And I personally believe that a buyback is very probable in the near future. And if this were to happen, then that would greatly change the supply and demand of this stock, which would enforce the stock price forward. And just to add the icing to the cake, if all that wasn't enough already, the general public has definitely taken a liking to this company. The ticker symbol HCMC is also being searched across the map right now, guys. As you can see here, it is trending on Google Trends, which is insane. And it has also been picking up some traction across some Reddit forums, as well as other forms of social media. So with all of this being said, guys, we can definitely see a lot of money coming in come Monday, and we can potentially see a giant short squeeze coming into the week. This company is definitely going to be one to watch coming into the week. So tomorrow, guys, have this on your watch list at the least. But anyways, that's all I've got for today's video. If you like my content, please think about subscribing. If you have any questions, leave a question in the comment section below. But other than that, guys, I'll see you guys Monday. Happy trading. Lucky Monday, guys.